Um, Mr. Tulsi, and we were discussing this with you earlier as well about Reliance Industries, the, um, the telecom and the retail vertical expected to do quite well. Do you think a lot of that is in the price? I mean, we've been talking about retail picking up since the last quarter too and telecom, everyone knows the way Relgio subscribers have been increasing. Um, you think the good news is already in or is there more to go? See, Sonia, after seeing the Q4 numbers, I've said that, you know, you are going to see a lot, many, lot, lot, lot of upside on the stock price. And I think maybe after Q4 numbers, you have seen the stock moving up by 20, 22 percent. But the best part, which I've been maintaining all along that, you know, the company has seen the end of the CapEx cycle. In fact, if you see two and a half lakh crore having invested by the company in Reliance Geo, which has been being made by last five, six years, will start yielding the results now. In fact, already we are seeing Reliance Geo in profit, you know, on the, on the PAT level. The Reliance Geo is reporting profits. So retail is again seen to be a very good story. Ten billion dollar turnover, you know, which we have seen for FY18. Obviously, with the stores additions or the uh, or the floor area increasing, you know, every every quarter, we are going to see very good numbers. I won't be surprised to see the uh, growth of about 30 percent on the top line for Reliance Retail with EBITDA of closure to about 4,000 crore for FY18. So, if you take all this into consideration, Petchem is again seen to be a very big kicker because of the of refinery off gas cracker plant having started which is giving a good synergy and if you really take all this into account i don't think that even refinery maybe for this quarter you may see the fall of about 10 20 cents to to, 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 to the grm maybe at 10.8 10.9 though we have been estimating it at 10.9 dollar per barrel so overall in fact now all the verticals have become quite healthy and quite rewarding going forward and we are in fact taking an estimate of eps closure to about 70 for FY90 or maybe, you know, uh, uh, think things will really be quite quite uh, 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 rewarding for FY20 as well. So taking all, all this into consideration, I think the stock has become a very uh, a must in portfolio kind of stocks. And even if you take on a historic earnings, you have a P multiple of 15 and you can't say that the company is now merely a refiner or maybe a pet chem company, which, 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 which carries a low P multiple. In fact, retail and 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 telecom both you know carry a high p multiple so if you take a blended multiple also you know you need to have a multiple of maybe closer to about 18 or 20. so taking all this into consideration increase in pat and the p expansion will really may make the stocks to remain invested for the next uh, 18 to 24 months